Hey guys, this is Denver or Misty Valley Paramount. If you want to see me transform myself to this, then definitely keep watching, because I'm just going to go ahead and get this tutorial started. So the first step is to dab a thicker concealer or thicker foundation everywhere that you need a little bit of extra coverage. Also apply it to the eyelids to get rid of any redness that may be in them. Next, buff out all your lines. Next, take a fairly lighter, one to two shades lighter than your skin tone, and apply this. And bring it all the way back to where you want your cheekbone to start. Top of the nose, underneath the lip, and the corner of the mouth, and dead center of the forehead, right here. Once again, we're going to buff everything out. Next, take a slightly darker foundation, apply it right here, right underneath your cheekbone. Bring it down. Right here, at the jawline. The temple, right here, coming up. and the side of the nose and buff everything out. Use a matte translucent powder lightly to set everything using vanilla by Ben Nye on a, on a tapered face brush apply this to the highlighted areas of your face using cork by Ben Nye using the other side of the same tapered brush Make sure you knock off the excess, apply this to the same areas where you contoured your face before. Using vanilla from Ben Nye, once again, apply this directly underneath your arch. Taking Ice Gold by Ben Nye on the tapered brush again, I'm going to apply this right to the top of the cheek. This is just going to add a nice golden shine and pull it back to where you want your cheekbone to start. Using a tiny little bit of cinnamon spice, this is an eyeshadow by Maybelline. I'm going to apply this right to the top of my cheeks as a bronzer. This is what it looks like, so it's quite uh, dark but shiny. And down the center of the nose and around the face. Use Black Track Fluid Line to tight line. To do that, I am going to tilt my head back and look down in the mirror and press this right up against in between the lashes. And also I'm going to bring it around using a very thin, very thin, in this case this is a concealer brush. Take the black and put it as close to the lash line as you can. We apply a thin line onto the bottom lash line. Also apply this to the lower waterline. And set with a black eyeshadow. The next thing I want you to do is take a blending brush and blend that top line ever so lightly and also right along the bottom. Just above my crease I'm going to take Cork by Ben Nye and I'm going to run this along the top of my entire crease from the wing that I created all the way to the inner part of the eye. Also I'm going to take Cork and once again I'm going to apply this right to the inner part of the brow right here. and. Go ahead and darken the corner, focusing more and more and more towards the crease, not going below the crease at all as you reach farther and farther in. Using Ice Gold by Ben Nye, I'm taking an all over shadow brush from Cupcake Cutie Cosmetics, and I'm applying that all over my lid. Apply a couple coats of your favorite mascara, put it at the bottom, wiggle, and pull through. 
And I'm going to take a tiny little bit of that iced gold and I'm going to place it right on the inner corner of my eye. I am taking a little bit of Desert Coral from MAC and I'm going to apply this as a blush. This is, sorry, Desert Coral by Ben Nye and I'm applying this as a blush. Using Ginger by Lise Watier, number 449, I am going to line my lips slightly larger than what they actually are. I'm now using Too Faced Mirror Mirror I'm Perfect Gloss. And my brush has a tiny little bit of red on it as well. The last thing I'm going to do is apply Wispy Lashes. You can see what a dramatic difference lashes make on the eyes. And I love these lashes. They're the cheap ones that you get in sets of 10 for like 2 bucks from eBay. Go ahead, purchase them. If you wish to highlight more, go ahead. Once again, I am just using Vanilla with Ben Nye. Never leave your face in a state that you don't like. Take the time to perfect it. That's the only way you're going to learn. And that's everything. I hope this was helpful to many of you. And until my next video, I hope you all have amazing days. Bye.